What's up guys, here we are in a new video. On this video, I'm going to teach you how to reach 70% viewers retention. What is retention? Retention is the average percentage of YouTube video that people watch. And videos with higher retention <laughs> have a better chance of getting promoted by the YouTube algorithm. So if you want a lot of viewers and subscribers, you have to get a very good retention so that YouTube will promote your content. How do you get a very good viewers retention? That's what this video will be teaching you today. When a lot of your viewers clicks on your videos and then exit after some few seconds, Seconds, certainly you are going to have a very bad retention so the big idea is to make them watch your video till end there are some few things I'll be teaching you right now and I promise that will boost your viewers retention let's get into it at first is from the shooting technique get a very good angle to set your camera not too far but a little bit closer and not too close after getting a very good angle make sure you are sitting in the center so you have to use your camera grid. The next thing is how you speak and interact with your viewers. For example, just watch this. Hello guys, here we are in a new video. On this video, I'll be teaching you how to get a very good viewers retention. And it's gonna be good, so let's get into it. And now, watch this. Sup guys, here we are in a new video. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to boost your audience retention. So stick and watch till end so that you will see all the steps. Let's get into it. And there's a big difference. If you are talking slowly and not active, your viewers will get bored and they will quit the video. You have to be active. Speak louder with confidence. When you are talking, make sure you are looking at the camera. And that makes your viewers engaged and will like to stay and watch the video till end. Before shooting a video, make sure you are having a head up of what you are going to say. Because without a head up seriously, you will be confused or even forget some points. Change your camera angle and background time to time. Just imagine eating the same thing in the morning, afternoon and night. No matter how delicious that thing is, you won't like to eat it anymore. And that's why you have to always introduce something new to your viewers. Like changing the camera angle or changing your background and things like that. And now we are done with the shooting part, most importantly, the editing part. This is your last chance to make your video amazing, so make every second count. When editing your videos, make sure you add jump cuts. Jump cuts is the zoom in and zoom out you see in clips, for example, this, this, this. That's what I mean by jump cuts. And almost every professional YouTuber or professional editor use this. And it's so simple. So after adding all your clips to your timeline, zoom in, in the first one and zoom out in the second one, zoom in, in the third one and zoom out in the fourth one. That's how it works. That's jump cuts. This resets your viewers' attention. Just watch this for example. Sup guys, here we are in a new video. In this video, we are going to talk about tech. All people use tech, so we are going to review some tech right now. And the first thing is, seriously, you get bored without jump cuts. Well, for example, just watch this. Sup guys, here we are in a new video. On this video, we are going to talk about tech. I'm going to review a product I'm having right now, and I promise you'll like that, you'll purchase it, because that's the best tech and cheap tech I have right now. So let's get into it. As you can see, you can spot a big difference because zooming in and out resets your viewers' attention, but just watching the same thing over and over and over again is very boring. So you like to quit the video. The next thing that makes your videos better when editing is cam bonds. Cam bonds is a slow zoom we use to make our videos look much better. For example, this is the slow zoom I mean, and it's also simple. Just go up here, crop, and then you can find cam bonds here. You can adjust it the way you like it and then done. That's all. A cam bone is added to the clip. The next thing is handheld effect. But I'm not going to show you that right now. I've made video earlier showing you all the good effects. If you want to check out the video, it's still on the channel. 10 best effects in Final Cut Pro. I'll leave a link in the description for that. So let's move on to the next one. The next thing is no static footage. Use a lot of bills. Use a lot of views of a picture or video of what you are talking about. For example, if you are talking about a device and you mention the charging port, make sure you have a charging port shot. Or you mention something related to the device, make sure you are having that shot. This introduces new view to the people watching the video and it's really good. People really like seeing different things. So don't just sit and always talk. Make sure you have some views you'll fix in your editing part. Or you can also use a lot of text. Using a lot of text makes your videos better. Because your viewers are reading at the same time, listening and watching you. So their brain is engaged and they won't be bored. And while they are watching, the seconds are still counting. Always be smiling and have a happy face when shooting a video. Just imagine something like this. What's up guys, here we are in a new video. On this video, I'm going to review an iPhone 7, an iPhone X and an iPhone 11. So let's get into it. <laughs> seriously, I can't imagine that seriously. That will look seriously bad. Just be happy, always smile. 
if you are in a bad mood make sure you don't shoot a video because that will look good and don't forget to always use transitions like this and don't forget to always use sound effects like this and it makes your videos better sometimes use a background song and make the volume low not too high so that it won't be disturbing and using background music enhances the mood and that's it i do this over and over and over again and a lot of my videos are having very good viewers retention so try this i promise it will work for you just keep making videos until then i'll see you guys in the next one peace